What's going on guys, it's Walrus, how are the kids, the women, and the children? I'm starting to get back into doing commentaries again, I'm starting to enjoy it. Uh, right now we're playing some Bioshock 2, this is just a, it's a 10 minute game, I just got the best highlights. Um, yeah, it feels so weird doing commentaries, I remember it felt like it was just yesterday I was watching Hutch on Modern Warfare 2, or White Boys World's Fastest Nuke, and now all of a sudden it's like, or even G-Unit's World's Fastest Fake Nuke. I just, it's so weird how, uh, oh son. If you've never played this before, basically you don't really shoot, you don't really aim down the sight, you hip fire, so don't think I'm, I'm some sort of noob or anything. But yeah, it's so weird that like commentaries are so out of style now. It's kind of a lost art, you know, not many people, not many people do it, and if they do do it, usually they're just complaining the whole time like Thunder, which I like Thunder, but I'm starting to get a little sick of the complaining, but anyway. So, Bioshock 2, to me this is some very underrated multiplayer. Uh, I really, really like this game a lot back in its day. And I um, basically went went back and playing it because I figured um, it's probably on its last leg. I doubt there's gonna be very much. Oh, I got killed by a, a proximity mine there. I doubt there's gonna be like very much time left for this game. The server's probably gonna be taken down, but it's still a lot of fun. So I decided to go back and start playing it. Um, I'm using the nail gun right now, and the reason this game was a lot of fun, like as you saw right there, that little electricity ball, that is a geyser, water geyser mixed with the electro bolt, which I have in my hand, and you can use that as a trap. Um, and, and there's you, you can you can use turrets You can use proximity mines on the on the uh, vending machines and This game was a lot of fun. I got, I got a big daddy suit right here. I got the big daddy suit right there Actually, no, right? Yeah, I did get it. Never mind I, I got I ended up getting two big daddy suits this game But one of them was really bad. So I just didn't even show you that one But this is the second one I got and this is why this game is the original Titanfall uh, Titanfall Three, 20 seconds till Titanfall. Uh, I'm in my Titanfall, son. What's up? I'm in my Titan. Anyway, so yeah, this game is very underrated multiplayer, in my opinion. To me, it was a lot of fun because the philosophy of the game was just to live in the whole Bioshock uh, universe, and 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 there is a lot of like really random, like fun stuff you can do. Like you, you can you can create all these different types of traps and stuff. And there's so much you can do in this game, and it's all balanced. Everything is balanced by something else. Like, for example, when you're not in the big daddy suit and you're just running around, um, you, you can, like, you can take pictures of people and it'll give you a damage bonus. It's like you're studying their body, so you know what, what hurts them more. So basically, you get a damage bonus, but then if they kill you, then their damage bonus gets taken away, then they can take a picture of you. And then they can get damage bonus on you. And you know, there's a lot of the things, a lot of the plasmids, or I guess the, the plasmids are the things you shoot with your hands. They all complement each other very well. And this game was a lot of fun. And really the only overpowered thing was the big daddy. <laughs> but there wasn't really too much, uh, too much like taking advantage of stuff. Like there's, there's really two things I can think of, which is the big daddy, which isn't really that bad because it's a random draw. There's like spots on the map. And if, if you know where the spots on the map are, you can get it more than others, but it's still pretty random, so it's not like you'll be able to get it every time. And the other thing is you can also use arrow dash and, and go around and uh, hit people with the uh, with the, your melee. You can use the arrow dash, which like zooms you, which makes you like run really quick or like teleport kind of towards your enemy. You can use that and the and the uh, you can charge up your melee and you can get like a one hit kill melee. But that's really the only thing that people really took advantage of in this game. Everything else was pretty balanced. The turrets weren't overpowered. They basically just finished people off for you and maybe here and there got a kill. I mean, this game was a lot of fun. It's the Big Daddy, I'm going ham with the Big Daddy. Uh, take that, son. Oh, I overheated. So anyway, yeah, this game, it kind of reminded me of Titanfall, the way you can get in a Big Daddy and go around and destroy everybody. So that's kind of why I went back and played it. Uh, I, it's, I kind of have a ridiculous death up here in the Big Daddy. But I mean, this game... It, the reason why it was fun was because it was balanced, but there was still a lot you can do. And to me, that's something that Call of Duty lacks these days. They always talk about how balanced it is, but usually there's always something that's better than everything else. And there's no fun factor. This game had the fun factor and it was balanced. There was also, every once in a while, there was some kind of janky uh, things that were happening with the hit detection. But, you know, this was an old game. Still a lot of fun though. Uh, I don't know how I died here, which I, I shot this guy like 14 times. He, he, he used the plasmid where you can like, or the tonic where you can fake die. Uh, okay, I missed the I missed the melee, which would have killed him. He used Houdini, so I couldn't see him anymore. I killed this guy. Then, then the other guy comes back that I thought I killed the first time. I, shot, I hit him like 94 times. 
and I died. Anyway, and then I get the final kill here. Like I said, 10 minute game, I had to move down to five minutes, but this game was a lot of fun. It has a fun factor, and it has a lot of combos that Call of Duty lacks. I hope Call of Duty can, can improve, but I mean, I'm having more fun with this than Ghost right now. So anyway, hope you enjoy that one-two punch combo on uh, Electrobolt Shotgun. 18, 16 and eight, talk to you guys later. <laughs>